friends, how's it going today? I have kind of a funny opening. We have two of these 151 poster collections. I'll tell you why I have both as we're opening the packs, but let's crack into them. So here's the poster. This thing is absolutely massive. I haven't opened the whole thing yet, but just seeing like this one little square, it's got the entire Kanto Pokedex on one side. And then on the other side, we have all of the cards from the regular part of the set, like not the full arts and the alternate arts and things like that. And it's really cool to just see these artworks without the card borders, or I guess the EX cards have the whole card. But anyway, this is a really pretty poster, but it's way too big. Now as a fun comparison, I actually have the Japanese version of the poster collection, so I have a couple of things to share related to that. So uh, here's the Japanese version of the card poster. It's just the full cards. It's a lot smaller. I think the one from the US is actually a lot prettier because you can see all the cards artwork in full glory, uh, but this is really cool too. I also wanted to show off briefly the binders that you get with the poster collection in Japan. So I was really excited about this one because it has a very nice picture of Charizard on it. It's also got Venusaur on the top, which you can can't see very well. And then Blastoise takes up the entire back, which is super cool. And then this one has all the silhouettes of the 151 Pokemon on it with a Pokeball sort of motif. I think that this one's really cool too. So I just thought I would share these because they're fun. And then of course we have our promo cards. I'm really excited about these. I love that the Scarlet and Violet era promo cards have these awesome sparkly borders on them. It's just so, so pretty. So I've got two of each because I have two boxes here. So here's the Charmander. Oh, he's so cute. I love all the artwork on all of these starters. It's so awesome. I love seeing them interacting with their environments like this and stuff. It's just so, so cool. I'll have to wait until later to see if there's any uh, swirls on these. It's kind of hard to tell uh, when I have my setup like this. And then finally we have Squirtle hanging out in the pond or a lake or something like that with some lily pads. Absolutely adorable. I'm really excited that I have doubles of these. I think it'll be cool to put them in a different, a couple different places in my collection. And then we also have a code card, so I'll put it on the screen while we get inside this. It's probably just going to be the promo cards. And then just for fun, I have the Japanese cards too. So these have the really cool Pokeball reverse holographic pattern that uh, one card in every 151 pack in Japan had. Uh, these are just promo cards, so you could just get them by buying the box. They're so, so fun. I really, really love this holographic pattern, so I'm really glad that I was able to buy these. Uh, again, I have two of each of these uh, to add to my collection, so I think it'd be fun to display the Japanese ones next to the uh, ones from the US as well. And then for our main event, we've got six packs of 151 goodness. I'm trying to decide if this is going to be my last 151 open that I upload. Uh, you know, Paradox Rift is coming out very, very soon, as in the time of I'm recording this anyway. Uh, and so I think that it'll be more exciting to focus on that instead of more 151, but we'll see. I do have a Zapdos EX collection box that I haven't opened yet uh, that maybe I'll record or maybe not. I don't know. But anyway, so we've got Leftovers, a Butterfree Reverse, a Rattata Reverse, and then we've got a Gengar Hollow, which is very cool. I think I just have the reverse version of that card, so it's very cool to have the regular Hollow. So I I ended up with two of these because I ordered one from the PokemonCenter.com uh, as soon as it got listed on the website because I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to find it locally. And then I went to GameStop and I realized that in order to get the Charmander promo card that they were giving out, you had to buy at least $15 worth of 151 specifically Pokemon cards. It couldn't have been any Pokemon cards. So I had to buy another collection uh, to be able to get the Charmander card. So I ended up with two, but it's still very fun to get six packs of 151 to open and we got a reverse rare multi trace which is very very beautiful then we've got a reverse victory bell and then we have a beedrill hollow which is very cool so if i'm remembering my binder correctly i believe that i'm mostly just missing the fossil pokemon like i don't have i don't have a kabuto or a kabutops at all yet i'm pretty sure uh so that would be exciting to see in this opening today so we got a dark energy a polywag pikachu farfetched shelter haunter golduck pincer we got a muck reverse Ooh, we have the Machoke illustration rare. Look at that. He's helping people move. That's so much fun. There's a Meowth over here too. Very, very cool. We see these Machoke movers all the time in the Pokemon games. So it's really fun to see sort of like a dollhouse representation of them helping move somebody. That's really cool. And then our rare is a Dodrio Hollow. I guess the other thing I'm still hoping for are the uh, Charmeleon and Charizard illustration rares. Uh, that would be absolutely incredible to get those. Uh, I have the Charmander, which I still can't believe, uh, but 
but I'd love the other ones too. And we have a awesome holographic grass energy. Very, very cool. I think I've gotten grass the most out of all of them. I don't have fighting yet at all, so I think that would be really cool to pull a fighting one. Uh, but I think having an extra grass is nice for trading purposes. So we've got a Parasect Reverse, a Shelter Reverse, and then a Beedrill Hollow. Oh no, we're doubling up on hollows already. We just have six packs too, come on. Oh, the other card that I'm missing is Metapod. I, I didn't realize that that's like a thing. Like lots of people are just missing Metapod. Uh, I was talking about it with one of my friends at Pokemon League the other day. And he was like, yeah, like, uh, there's a joke about how if you get a reverse Metapod, it's like more rare than the Charizard, which I think that is very, very funny. I don't think it's actually true, uh, but it is funny that like nobody has a Metapod. So we're gonna make you reverse. And then a Kangaskhan EX. All right, so this is a double on uh, my Kangaskhan EX, but still very cool to see an EX card in our opening. We've got an illustration rare in EX. So hopefully this pack has some wonderful last pack magic for us, uh, but I guess we've hit our ratio. But, but I really would like to get something that's sparkly that I don't have yet. Like I didn't, oh, there's the fighting energy. <laughs> awesome, okay. Well, I guess we've gotten something sparkly that I didn't have yet. And there's a swirl up there too. Very, very cool. I love that. Oh, awesome. My binder is going to be complete now. Well, at least the, the energy part is. So we got a Zubat, a Goldeen, a Nidoran, Ghastly, Parasects, a Giovanni's Charisma, a Grabber. I don't think I had the Grabber card yet either. Then we got a Machop Reverse. A Seeking Reverse, and our final rare is a Beedrill. What the heck? We've got three Beedrills in this opening? That's that's very strange. So that was kind of an absurd opening. We've got Hypno to add to our Pokédex. This is our only new one for our Pokédex, but still very, very fun. Then we've got a Reverse Rare Moltres, a Holographic Grass, and Fighting Energy, which is new for my collection too, but doesn't have a Pokédex number, so uh, that's not as exciting for the Pokédex anyway. Then we got three Holographic Beedrills for some reason. I don't know why they love me so much today. Then we got a Dodria a Gengar, and then our Kangaskhan EX, which is very cool. Hopefully I can trade somebody for something uh, with this Kangaskhan EX. And then finally we have our Machoke Illustration Rare, which is just so fun. I love adding illustration rares to my collection. I hope to have all of them someday. So I'll give you guys this 151 booster code. Comment and let us know what you got so that we know that you've taken it. So thanks for watching everybody, and I'll catch you all on the flip side.